Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 32 to the power of 4 minus 4 to the power of 8 and we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. So here calculator is not allowed in this problem. It means that we need to do all of the working on this paper. So uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to focus on the basis of both of these terms and now here uh, we know about 32 uh, so we see here 32 is equals to 2 to the power of 5 and we know that the base of this term is 4 and 4 is equals to 2 square. So now we replace these two values to the given expression so that our given expression is written as uh, so this will be written as 2 to the power of 5 and its whole power is 4 minus this is 2 to the power of 2 and its whole power is 8 and after that we need to do here uh, this we need to apply this exponent law you know that a to the power of m to the power of n is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so according to this exponent law we multiply these two exponents and it will be written as 2 to the power of 5 to the power of 4 so these two exponents are multiplied by each other and we get 2 to the power of 5 times of 4 minus 2 to the power of 2 times of 8 so it is equals to 2 to the power of 20 minus 2 to the power of 16. So here we break this 2 to the power of 20 as we write 2 to the power of 16 plus 4 minus we have this is 2 to the power of 16 and we again um, break this exponent uh, and we write this term as 2 to the power of 16 multiplied by 2 to the power of 4 minus this is 2 to the power of 16. So further in the next step uh, we have uh, here we need to take common 2 to the power of 16 and we get the remaining values are this is 2 to the power of 4 minus 1 and now uh, we know about uh, 2 to the power of 4 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 16 so we write it as 2 to the power of 16 into 16 minus 1 uh, so this implies that uh, it is 2 to the power of 16 multiplied by 15 so now here uh, our next claim is to find the value of uh, 2 to the power of 16. So we write this 2 to the power of 16 as 2 to the power of 2 multiplied by 8 and it is multiplied by 15. So here we move uh, this uh, uh, 8 inside the term and it will be written as 2 to the power of 8 and its whole square and it is multiplied by 15. So in order to find the simplified form of the given expression we first need to find the value of 2 to the power of 8. So 2 to the power of 8 means that we need to multiply this 2 with 8 times and this is 3 times 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 and 2 multiplied by 2. So this is uh, 2 is multiplied by 8 times. Uh, so here you see that 2 2s are 4 and 4 2s are 8 and 8 2s are 16 and 16 times of 2 32 32 times of 2 is 64 64 times of 2 128 128 multiplied by 2 is equals to 256 so it means that uh, the value of uh, 2 to the power of 8 is equals to 256 so now we replace this value here so that our uh, this expression is implies that we put 2 to the power of 8 equals to 256 and it's a whole square and it is multiplied by 50. So in the next step we write this 256 as 256 multiplied by 256 multiplied by 15. So further in the next step we need to multiply these to bigger numbers. So now you see here I can just do this product uh, directly in our mind. Uh, I, here I cannot use any calculator or any calculations in this paper. So you see here first we break this number as this is 256 we write this 256 as 200 plus 50 and plus 6 and here you have this is 15. so now in the next step we need to multiply this 256 with each of these values and it will be written as 256 
multiplied by 200 and plus 256 multiplied by 50 and plus 256 multiplied by the 6 and at the last we multiply our resulting answer with 15. So now here in the next step uh, we need to uh, do these and do all of these products here and you see that uh, so now we can multiply 256 with this 200 uh, so here we consider this is our one digit number and this is our three digit number so when you multiply zero with any number you get the resulting answer is zero so zero times of this number becomes zero and this zero times this number is also becomes zero and this two times of this number is equals to two six or twelve we write 2 and carry 1, 2 5 is a 10, 10 plus 1 is 11, we write 1 and carry 1, 2 2 is a 4, 4 plus 1 is 5. So you get here 51,200 only and plus here you need to multiply this 256 with these two numbers. So when you multiply 0 with this number, we again get 0, 5 times of this number is equals to 5 6 is a 30, we write 0 and carry 3. 5 5 is a 25, 25 plus 3 28, we write 8 and carry 2, 5 2 is a 10, 10 plus 2 becomes 12. So we write here 100, 128,000 plus, we need to multiply this 6 with the 256 and you see here 6 6 is a 36, we write 6 and carry 3, 6 5 is a 30, 30 plus 3 becomes 33, we write 3 and carry 3. 6 2 is a 12, 12 plus 3 becomes 15 and at the last it is multiplied by 15. So further in the next step uh, here we need to uh, sum up uh, all of these three values and it will be written as so first you have this 0 plus 0 plus 6 is equals to 6 and this 0 plus 0 plus 3 is equals to 3 this 2 plus 8 becomes 10 10 plus 5 is 15 we write 5 and carry 1 this 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 1 is 4 and 4 plus 1 is equals to 5 and 5 plus 1 is 6 so we write uh, this 6 here and at the last we need to multiply it with 15 and we write this 15 as 10 plus 5 so that now we multiply this number with these two values and it will be written as 6 double 5 3 6 multiplied by 10 and plus 6 double 5 3 6 is multiplied by 5. So when it is multiplied by 10 so we just write this 0 here it will be written as 6 double 5 3 6 and 0 plus here we need to multiply this 5 with this number and you get 5 6 is 30 we write 0 and carry 3. 5 3 is a 15, 15 plus 3 is 18, we write 8 and carry 1, 5 5 is a 25, 25 plus 1 is 26, we write 6 and carry 2, 5 5 is a 25, 25 plus 2 is 27, we write 2 and carry 2, we write 7 and carry 2, 5 6 is a 30, 30 plus 2 becomes 32. So here our final step is that we need to sum up these two numbers and you obtain 0 plus 0 is 0, this 6 plus 8 is 14, we write 4 and carry 1, this 3 plus 6 is 9, 9 plus 1 is 10, we write 0 and carry 1, this 5 plus 7 uh, becomes here 12, 12 plus 1 is 13, we write 3 and carry 1. So 5 plus 2 is 7, 7 plus 1 is 8 and 6 plus 3 becomes 9. So this is the our final simplified form of the given question. This is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.